Welcome back everyone to a fresh YouTube video. I hope you're all doing all right with our Luke now in my house. I do people. Well, today people, we've been sent this. These two items from Top Don. Battery jump starter and a battery tester. And a battery tester this, sent to us. They're saying this is the newest one out. It's only in America at the minute, they're saying, but it's coming over here soon. So it wasn't first to have it, I think. The GS3000. Let's have a quick look at yeah, it. Yeah, did them open up, Luke, see what's going on. Appreciate you sending me these, Top Dom. That's your need, this. There's a car with a battery need to So look, first time I've opened these, so... Well built, isn't it? So have a look what's in here. Instructions, I'm a bloke, so I won't need them. So <laughs> I won't read them. Some crocodile clips in there, if you know. But, look at this. Back Christmas, eh? <laughs> the first thing I've ever been sent. <laughs> a good bit of kit isn't it? Let's have a look, power. Oh 75% so I think that'll be enough to start. See if we've got a torch on the end of it. Torch on as well. Some boost button. One minute. There you go. Ooh, it's right, right, That's ideal that, finding jump leads and stuff in it when you need to put it on it now when you get batteries for that. Hold that on. So it's just 75%. I think we should go try this. We'll we've, got try little, we've got a little fiesta what needs jump started. That's the one. Let's see if it does it, eh? We've also, like I say, got this 12 volt battery tester as well. So we're going to show you how that works as well on some old batteries that we've got. Exciting. This is. this is good. Things are playing out. People are sending us things. It's but. Let's just plug and play this. You can't, you can't really go wrong with it. It's just. There we go. Right, let's go and test it on, on a car out back. Yeah, let's go and start something. <laughs> <laughs> right, see you soon, people. Right, people, this is the one for yesterday we're going to test this top down on. Going to prove that it's some flat loot. Can you hear that? See, don't we We need to get these weighed in now, don't we, as well? Cats are right. back at the engine on this, though. Let's have a look. Proof is in the buddy. I'll tell you what, they're a good grade. Power's on, green lights on. Is that right? You all back there, do you? Let's give this a whirl, guys. Look at that. No problem, that Luke, were it? That's a very surprised, lad. Good thing, them, aren't they? Let's try some help, now. Yeah, we've been around trying everything. Why else we try? Should we try that tranny van or not? I think it could be a long job, but let's try it then. That transit, that pick up there, we have showed you that, but that's been uh, led up for ages. I bought this off, off the marketplace um, over the weekend, I got it dropped off. Crew cab tipper, but engines playing up. I think turbo's gone up bottom end or something. It's been stood under a bloody tree for, for ages. I think it's been at bottom of a lake. But we sold that one. We got I'm gonna pick that one up there as well. The tip, another tipper. A tipper. So oh, I've got the keys here. Yeah, we sold the pair of them to a friend of mine. He's gonna make a good and out the pair. Couldn't find one when we wanted one of these. No. There's that all five plate one there. Gee, that one's rotten. This one's not so bad. This old girl's been stuck for a while though. Yeah, I'll, have a look. I'll show you. There's no battery lights on it. There, uh, look, key in. Nothing coming on. Nothing, right. Nothing coming on with. Nothing on radio or like that. So, now I'll give it back to you. Let's see how we go. I'd be, I'd be happy if it's wide, though. Yeah, yeah, just winding it over because, like I said, it's been. You can see what. But calipers and stuff like this have been stood for a long time. I think last time we tested this was 2018, I think. Reckon it's gonna start, but it's only 75% charge, it's a big old lump. This bugger, see how we go. Oh, the stag's on eBay now as well. Check it out if it's still if it's uh, still available because it ends probably tomorrow, I think, or Tuesday. Is it on board? Yes. 
bad boy for Christmas. <laughs> I'll just show you a bit of scrap what got chucked on over the weekend. We ain't collected this, someone just come and dropped it off. A um, couple of mowers, petrol mowers there, look. And a bar I think that barbecue was already on, but yeah, a couple of petrol mowers that have been chucked on the back. I need to get my alloys weighed in as well. How are we looking, Luke? It's got a good tipping body on this truck as well. Should have took it off really for hours, but profit's profit, you know that, guys. Got to take a wage. Thought it were a freeway tipper, but it's not. But still, we're flooring it as well. Done about 160 or 1,000 miles, I think, this one. Oh, some fuses off. There we go. Right. Try it. This is this is not. This is not. Uh, she's lit up. She's lit up. Hundred percent not stage or anything like that. We don't know. It might start. It might not. But we'll be straight with you. But if it turns it over, I'll be happy. Give it a couple of eight. Come on, lad. Is it mobilised itself? Mobilised itself. Mobilised. No, it's still ah. transit. Bloody hell. Mobilised. Anticlimatic or what? Right, well, so we've got to try this other tipper here. Yeah, I've took the battery off that one. Eh? I've took the battery off it, but it should. That one drove here. So. <laughs> Told you we're not prepared, us boys. We're not bothered though. We'll have a look. Let's have a look for about 500 Ford keys that we've got. One, two, three. One of these, anyway. We'll have a look at this one, eh? Try this one. Alright. Let me double check keyboard. I don't know if it'll start it with no back on as well, but we're going to give it a try. We've got to put it to its test. What the hell? Look. <laughs> That's the one. Got it. That's the key. No battery on this one. Seventy-five percent. No battery. That's uh. Let's press that the green light on. There we go. Try it. All it not in gear, is it, bud? No. One thirty-three. It's done. <laughs> I'd be, if it's no battery, I'd be surprised. Look at that on the button. <laughs> well, that is good. Start a tranny van up. Engine's got sweet and nut in that as well, yeah. isn't it? To start, start a tranny van up with no batteries on. That's good going. That. Happy with that? Yeah, we're happy with that. I'll leave all the links in the uh, description box to, the, to these products as well so you can have a look at them yourself and get them bought um, Right, we're going to get this stag off now and uh, we're going to get a couple of cars waiting the thing so see you shortly guys, oh go on Oh yeah, we'll test the battery shortly, yeah later on in the video eh? Yeah, I'm really impressed with that That'll do Right people we're going to get this little Chevrolet weighed in now. The old nine plate it is. Cat on the front. Are you backing down? Yeah, it's going to get far. Well, it's going to back down to it now. It's got it's got the uh, cat on the front. About under a quid, I think the cat on it. A little poxy engine, but there's the cat at the front. And then, oh, my uh, clutch went on my ST the other day. Oh, Luke had to drag me back with his uh, Passat, so she's won it, Ben. Shame because they're a good car, that for pigeons. Tested till January as well, but it is what it is, guys. Get them scrapped. 
and then we're just going to get through these that bmw needs to go and the mitsubishi needs to go get the money in the bank right let's get this winched on right these gonna have a do go on d see if you can do it first time there we go go on there you go like Mario Kart. <laughs> we we poured into it. <laughs> right, let's get this one done. That were only three bolts on uh, manifold to get cat off front of that one. Quite a simple one. Not a route, eh? Yeah. It's sure, could you? Look at the block line, it's about 500 BH today. We might have lost a quid in there. Okay. No, you're not lying to me, Dean. Dean just don't want me rooting, does he? I think he's been in and rooted it himself. No, any boy. Yeah. Send, send Luke some gloves and we'll start and I'll root them. <laughs> send me gloves when you root them. Yeah, keep on quids then. <laughs> right, let's get this one strapped. Get a strap on. Get your strap on. I'm sorted. <laughs> right, we'll get to yeah, we'll see you soon, people. Right folks, right here are now. Just weighing in, but there's a customer in before us. I forgot to mention to you as well the Jumbo Transit, we had the 08 plate one, the 2.4 one. We sold that for export, it's gone to Georgia. A guy picked that up on Saturday morning, so that's gone over there. Um, yeah, so he wants, to, he wants more of them, so we're gonna keep an eye out for more of them. And then we can make a few quid on them. A few cars have been weighed in, an old Range Rover over there, if you can see it, I'm not sure. Peugeot's and old Polo and Alfa Romeo. So yeah. It's all good, it's all good. I'm gonna give this a test out when we get home as well. Go through the scrap batches that we've got and anything, any decent ones, we can put to one side and keep hold of. So, see how we go. Right, I'll see you shortly. Right people, we're back the uh, day who's gone. We had a phone call off a friend of ours saying uh, your garage is here and I've had a break in. So, over the weekend, the local scrots have uh, They've tried gaining ripping sheets up off a roof. Nothing in the garages anyway. So it's just a shite really. That one they barred the middle open. I haven't got in that one. But they're not took nothing. Ripped all this door off here. So I'm gonna walk around the garages. Through here. I've come around here, obviously because they're not disturbed it now. They've uh, broken in here. But obviously as you can see it's just drain pipes and draining rods and a wheelie bin. Nothing of any expense in here. Otherwise it had gone. You can tell things are tightening up now, people are starting to get broke into. They've been alright for a good couple of years. But anyway. Let's try to bark the roofs up, haven't they? Oh shit. So uh, Dean's gone to sort his pigeons out. I'm gonna uh, get some boards cut to size and board these up. Get them screwed up, that's all I can do, innit? Well, I were going to take all them uh, prickly bushes away from Sab, but they can definitely stay there now. Now, now they're coming back into flower, they can definitely stay there. That one's been alright. So, anyway. Right, I'm going to get this boarded up at the end of here and get this sorted around here. See you soon. Right, people, we're back. Wednesday morning. Just going to weigh a few in this morning to Blackburn and get them in. First one to go is that old silver Mitsubishi estate. Gonna get shot. We've had petrol out of it. Three quarters of a tank. That's all right. We're just gonna get cat off front of this. Have a quick look. The old tree here. Yeah, there's two. One underneath and one manifold bit. So bear with me a minute. Oh, we had a lot of interest off Bangor lads wanted to buy this and stuff, but for it's what we bad. get for what we get weighing it in, it's not worth us messing about. No. I bet they're on export as well, I mean, just probably. They probably are, but it's got a cat up front there, which I'm going to mess around and get off now, and then uh, one underneath. No, that's right, then it's easy to get out of that, isn't it? That's so bad. We got that sorted. Good, good. Oh, I picked this course up as well, uh, but there it is. Yes, the Tuesday. Yeah, it's one of them flat ones, not the round barrel. Petrol course there. Bought it off a lad who had, who I bought a few things off, a local lad. Stuart, good lad. You, you can tell me about us, uh, deal we did with 
Yeah, we'll do. What we managed to swap for it? No. Oh, the Audi A3. Good little deal you had there. Yeah, we managed. Well, the Audi A3, but that's that blue one we had there. A chap, a friend of mine, turned up and said he needed the engine out, but desperate for it. Anyway, same chap we sold the Dayatsu Terios to. So he's given me the Dayatsu Terios, a snap-on socket set, all brand new, well more or less brand new, everything in it, and a Dewalt buzz gun, same as what we've got a Mac one, Dewalt the same thing. Swapped it to that, so can't argue with that. And we got the shell back, which was split with him. So yeah, a good little deal there. Um, his friend Matty Luke, he said that his mate wants the front end off his BM, but whether he turns up, I don't know. Oh, another mate of ours, Jaden. He said he wants a shout out, he never gets a shout out. No, nah, we're not. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Jaden. Well, that seemed with funny air doing it, like a bit of a, la yeah, a bit ladies' of, man, innit? It thinks he's a ladies' man, innit? Yeah, he thinks he's one of the lads, isn't that? <laughs> I've already took the fuel out of this, my mate Mark took this. We did a deal with him. We swapped him some white diesel. And that had a full tank of petrol in it, so he's took that. And uh, he's used all his petrol for training our pigeons, with, which is good. So I'm deciding I'm I'm going to put a clutch in that Mondeo. Are you doing it? Yeah. You I can't replace you can't replace that for 800 quid, can you? Great right, people, leave in the comments if you think Dean's talking a bit of you know what, because you know what happens to everything he has. This is I'm going to do. He gets crushed. <laughs> no, I can't replace that. It's got a Tesla January on it, it's a good one. Good bus. I think you've just lied right to me face, Eddie. No. And to everyone's face on, on YouTube. They're all gonna give you some sticks in what you're lying for, dude. I'm just it's getting Light fixed. Bar. It's getting fixed, boys. Who's, have you priced the clutch up? Maybe a couple of hundred quid. Maybe about 400 quid to supply yeah. for it. Yeah, so when you... <laughs> mm. <laughs> which price is it, which day are you living in, mate? What do you mean? Never. Never in a month of Sundays. I'm not putting a dual mask back in, let's put a solid one back in. Is anyone local want to put that clutch in that for me? There's money here, cash on the hip, ready to go. Cash on the hip. Cash in the hip, ready to go. Cash in the hip. I'll drop it off if you're local. I'll supply the clutch, just fit it, because I have not got a clue what I'm doing. Oh, Luke won't give me Luke won't give me his Passat to trade my pigeons with. You broke the clutch out of towing your back over there with that sack of shit. <laughs> right, we're going to get this uh, cat off, guys, and get it winched on, and let's get it to the scrapyard, get some money in the bank. Well, Batchy were just going on GoPro, weren't it? But I forgot, we got this buddy. Top done GS3000 in, I forgot. It charges all my, uh, my GoPro as well and my phone through the outlet there, which is good. GS3000, there'll be a link in the description. I think you get 10% off as well with a cord I'm gonna put in for you as well. So that's good. Anyway, back to this scrap car. Right people, we read your comments in the last video we put on regarding the window wipers. We're just at A1 Motor Stores now in Padium, the old White Horse pub. And we're going to pick uh, some fresh ones up so we don't get shouted out of you guys. <laughs> Sorted. I think our kids are getting them now. Oh, he's done it. Oh, he's done it. Look at that. Hey, go on, Martin. So, right, we're gonna get it fitted. Right, people, we're back. The Mitsubishi's gone. Went a bad way in. I told you, like, say, it's not even the end of this video, and I've told you what had happened, didn't I? The Mondeo's going for scrap now. We've just picked a van up. A little uh, 1700 T. Uh, are they TD these days? I don't think it has, but they think it's a No, it's the early engine. The good engine. Is that the one with cat up front? No, I, don't think, I think the cat's underneath on these. But this is going to be his new pigeon bus. I told you, not even end of video. Look, he's changed his mind. It is what it is, boys. It's a good wagon, that, isn't it? Prof profit, isn't it, Dean? Yeah, that's the one. I tell you what, we used to get it going as well. It was flat. Oh, yeah. It's top down uh, back to jumper. Worked a treat. So this is his new bus. I don't know what miles on it. There's no, nothing coming up off it. Ah, it'd be right. New pigeon bus. Sliding door. Sliding door. Even a spare old battery in the boot. Am I going to test that battery thing on it? Yeah, we'll, we'll check some batteries with his, uh, with his battery tester. Let's have a look, see what's good and what's bad. Our truck needs a good clean out. So this is it, top down. BT100. BT100, a battery tester for 12 volt. 
We also got some tyres from uh, Scrapyard, like brand new for his Sprinter. You open that up, Dean. Let's have a butchers. Right, you do this. You're you're the technical man. I don't understand all this. Carry on, but let's have a walk. Let's have a walk. They were a spare batch. You left it back at Vanier. We've got some batches back at that old sprint as well. What we put with the odd car. So we'll test a couple of those. Yeah, she turned on. He comes on with the. Uh, how does it come on at the thing? The battery. So that one's absolutely cream crackered. Yep. So we know that's a bad one. Right, let's have a look around here. Good. That was cream crackered as well. I think they're all bad, that's why they're in here. <laughs> there must be one way better. Plenty of PBM and, and SBR. SB half of them are going to build back to get the house to build. Plenty of building materials. Keep them got same up with today's prices. Oh, there we go, we've got a bit of life. Top down, back tester. It says there how many volts are at the bottom. 5.34 volt. Yeah, so that's that one we're knackered will do. Power too low to reset after charging. Knackered. Alright, let's have a look. What's that one? See, we have all the good stuff, you see. That's negative. They'll all be knackered, that's why we end up with them. 12.32 volt. Well, that one alright then. Have a look. And to battery test. Regular flooded. See is it? It is. Hey, it's one minute. Battery test. Regular flooded. Again, enter. 300A in it, 300A. Tested. Let's have a look. Hopefully that's a phone call for another car. Bad as you see the red lights turned up there. Replace elf 27%, charge 47, 17.6 mil homes. So, no, that's a bad one. It comes up clear there. A bad one. So, more do you need? How simple is that? You need to check these out. There'll be a, a link in the description for these on his video. But that'll come in handy that when we test the batteries to see what we what need weighing in and what, what we keep. So that's works to treat us that. So yeah, it works to treat that day, it? it says it's better battered. So like I say there'll be a link in the description for that one. Yeah. Um oh yeah, there's there's 10% off on the top down uh, jump pack. But these uh I don't know if there's anything on these ones at the minute because they're just getting the website built or something. Right here. But like I say, all the links will be in the description. That's what like it I say, we're, we're, we're uh, we're up there now, boys. <laughs> you know what I mean? First thing we've ever been sent. So, like I say, we're not testers. We're just scrap lads, but we're happy to test anything. If you want to send us stuff to test, send it and we'll test it and review it. Yeah, that's it. Are we ending video? Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Great, Dino. Don't forget to keep commenting, liking and subscribing. And um, ring the bell. Ring the little bell. Ring the little bell and you'll get notifications of his videos as soon as they go on. And keep an eye on them shorts. And TikTok and Instagram are on there as well. You get daily snippets. So, see you soon, people. Have a good one. See you later, guys.